I know some of you are already thinking of bringing pots and pans to uni. If you are an international student, why would you bring pots and pans and rice cooker all the way from your country to UK? Hello everyone, this is Rachel and today I'll be sharing you some tips on what to pack for university. But first of all, congratulations for your next chapter in your life. Moving out of home and studying in a different country or different city can be really exciting and you really should be proud of yourself. Let's start with some special tips for the international student. I know you're coming to university in another country but that doesn't mean you have to bring everything from home being an international student myself i understand the packing limitation that you might face usually airlines allow 30 to 35 kg of baggage for economic travelers however you can take advantage of student clubs or free membership to enjoy extra luggage allowance for instance before i come to uk i applied the Qatar airway student club membership and got the additional 10 kg of extra luggage along with some discount so always check out the different airlines for benefits and take advantage of them and most importantly do not pack things that you can buy easily in uk all right so now let's move on to some tips so tips number one is important documents first and foremost don't leave your home without your essential documents these include your passport your visa documentation university acceptance letter and cast statement academic transcripts like english proficiency test results and your a-level results accommodation contract insurance documents bank cards and some cash and prescription copies and any other necessary paperwork and keep them in an easily accessible place like your backpack because sometimes the immigration might ask for these kind of documents okay so now let's move on to tip number two which is the weather appropriate clothing if you're heading to uk the weather in september is usually around 10 to 15 degrees celsius and tends to be a bit rainy so be sure to bring a raincoat or a waterproof jacket also pack a variety of clothing suitable for both warm and cold weather but mostly uk is quite cold mainly because i come from like a tropical country where the weather is like hot so uk is like a bit cold for me but it's wise to bring clothing for both cold and warm weather so you can consider bringing t-shirts and crop tops jeans dresses and skirts tampers sweatshirts and sweatpants raincoats and winter coat underwear pajama business formal or smart outfit shoes trainers and socks and fancy outfit for all the welcome parties at university now let's move on to another tip which is bedroom and kitchen essentials your bedroom is gonna be your personal space so it's important to create a comfortable environment even though we said don't overpack you might want to bring some things from your bedroom that will make you feel more like home and also before you start packing your entire room always check with your landlord to understand what they are providing already especially ask for the bed side to buy the correct size of bed sheets so some common items that you need to bring to uk or that you have to buy when you arrive to uk are beddings duvets pillows and their covers laundry bed basket, hangers, and storage boxes, some accessories to decorate your room such as photo from home, microwave, safe, bowl, and plates, and set of cutlery, a small pot and pan, some utensil, hair dryer, bath towels, cosmetics, and some of the skincare products. But like I said before, if you are an international student, do not bring any of these, any of the bed and stewards pillows don't bring them you can find easily in uk i'll also mention some places where you can buy these items easily in uk now tip number four is bring your comfort food hands up if you are a food lover i am a food lover so when i come half of my bag is food also i kind of recognize that the first problem that most international students face when they arrive to uk is food because we're not familiar with all these british cuisines and the initial week of university life can be a bit overwhelming so have a familiar snacks from home can be really really comforting in my personal experience i brought a lot of traditional instant noodles a lot of curry paste and a lot of my favorite snacks to university i'm not gonna lie but i brought a 10 kg whole bag full of snacks and it was the best decision i've ever made when i packed for university so bring the food you will thank yourself later for bringing the food trust me all right so tip number five is other essentials if you are on any prescribed medication bring all of them because buying them in uk is not really easy in my experience i couldn't buy one acne gel without the prescription so i ended up buying that one gel from another country and ended up paying a lot of money for that so bring all the prescribed medication that you need because buying them here is not that easy also it's good to bring your first aid kit some over-the-counter remedies for common problems like cold flu 
headache and allergies I know I don't need to say this but don't forget to bring a laptop, iPad, phone chargers and any other electronic devices that you need to study A power strike can also be a useful addition to ensure that you have enough power outlet for all your devices Alright so this video is coming to an end and I'm gonna recommend some places where you can buy all of these things in UK very easily So for me, Wellco, Amazon, Argos and Primark are my personal favorite to buy the beddings and bed sheets and all the kitchen utensils and it, literally every single thing that you need When you arrive in UK, take a trip to your nearest shopping mall or when you're coming to Manchester, take a trip to Arundel which is in the city center to buy all of these essentials Personally, I prefer Wellco and Primark for beddings and some kitchen utensils and Amazon and Argos for other items like bathroom essentials and some tiny things Also, one good thing about Primark is that they have like cute stationery and you know cute little things to decorate your room so take a trip to Primark when you arrive in UK and all the products in Primark are quite cheap compared to other brands so definitely take a look at Primark Also, whenever you are buying something, don't forget to use student discounts and free memberships take advantage of being a student usually they have like 10% discount so take advantage of them Alright, so this is basically what you need to pack for university so in summary, just remember to have a balance between bringing what you need and avoiding overpacking before you pack, think twice do I need to buy this in UK? and if the answer is yes, it's better to leave them at home and food is the most important thing please bring food, okay? you will thank yourself later, trust me so go ahead and pack your bags your next adventure awaits bye bye and see you in the next video